Those are some pillow marks. You must have been out like a light. You know, there's a showing of Loveless about to start. And I've got two tickets to it. We should go. Also, the Skywheel's running a special for couples. Limited time only. For couples? As in... I'll leave that up to your imagination. It's more fun that way. What about the others? Forget about them. For now, anyway. Oh. Come on. Congratulations. <laughs> Would you like to sing it? Me? Hey, is this a bad time? Hey, what's up? Nothing. Couldn't find anyone. Thought they might be here. Just me. Oh. Actually, there's this play I want to see, and would you mind coming with? I already have the tickets, but look at me. There's no way I'm getting in by myself. I got you. You do? Great! See you again. 
you again soon, Kuto! Loveless. Her stirring performance. Audience members will also be invited to participate in tonight's revival. <laughs> Attention, Event Square guests. Could Makeup Bloom? That's Makeup Bloom. Please Let's go. speak to a member of the staff at your earliest convenience. Thank you. Attention, Event Square guests. <laughs> Could Makeup Bloom? That's Makeup Bloom. Please speak to a member of the staff at your earliest convenience. Thank you. Attention, Event Square guests. Could Makeup Bloom? That's Makeup Bloom. Congratulations. <laughs> Would you like to sing it? Me?
That lady was beautiful. Yeah. Hell of an actor, too. Mechanical metropolis built of blood, sweat, and gears. The city of Garya. An insatiable machine devoid of pity. Neighbors on all sides fell victim to its hunger while it grew larger and ever more powerful. The whirlwind of conquest swept up many, including him. Malfrey was the traveler's name. In search of the goddess's blessing, he had journeyed forth alone. He flung himself into the fray in the hope of becoming a hero, only to be flung in jail and branded a felon. Proceed or not to proceed. These bars shall not hold me. I must fly free. Release me! My blade thirsts for vengeance! How did you find me? Your woeful cries could not fail to reach mine ears. through my veins. I shall give you ample cause to rue this day. Tremble in fear before the mighty dragon's roar!
Bravo! What a splendid show! Never have I seen a swordsman dance with such grace and skill! The goddess must have seen fit to grant him a sliver of her strength. Perhaps his dreams of becoming a hero may yet be fulfilled. Now then. Ha! Hail and well met, noble Alfred. Though I am but a humble fool, some talent and divination do I possess. Anything you wish to know, I shall gladly reveal. What is the future, if not the product of choices past? Each a fork in the road. None can divine the conclusion of every path. And yet, all tales that begin with a chance encounter share the same end. A tearful farewell. Well, that's enough of my blethering. It's time we set the stage in you. May my infernal fangs find their mark and taste of your flesh. display of swordsmanship, enough to prove his heroism once and for all. He had been unjustly imprisoned and stripped of his wings. Nevertheless, Alfred was resolved to press onward and reclaim the heavens. Now, without further ado... Friends, lend me your ears. Our aspiring heroes and indomitable princess's tale draws to a close. Only one act remains. Parting is indeed such sweet sorrow, but as they say, all good things must come to an end. Though it is our wish that this tale remain with you long after we are gone. So, my friends, will you join us in our conquest of despair? Spectacular! Though our tale be loveless named, we may yet restore hope to this heartbroken world. The Dragon King Varvados fears only true love, and so our hero Alfred will reveal to him its power. He will go to his beloved and proclaim their blessed bond with a kiss. Now, stand before your soulmate and let the world know your heart. I love. Alfred. Ah, face the charade. Love is not but an illusion. Goddess above, let my blade strike true.
bereft of wings and broken. I consign you to the abyss. An inspiring victory, truly. Proof that love indeed conquers all, is it not? <laughs> what awaits you at Journey's End, I wonder? Will the goddess grant you her blessing? Or will the flames of vengeance consume you? All shall be revealed, O oh puppet of fate. So dance while you still have time. Dance to your frayed strings break, and you can dance no more. Alfred, look. Must you go? Those I hold dear are waiting. I don't understand. I cannot. But... Please be safe. Rest assured, I shall return. You needn't promise that you'll wait. For I know that I will find you here. some rest. Yeah, I know. But I'm too excited to sleep. I need to do something to let out all this pent-up energy. Like see a play or ride the sky wheel. That's so. <laughs> Plus, you've been frowning so much I figured you forgot how to smile. That's where I, the amazing Yuffie, come in. Are you here to see Loveless? Also be invited to participate in tonight's revival. Once the show has begun, both late and... <sighs> Attention, Red <laughs> Square guests. Could make them bloom. That's make them bloom. Come on, let's find Please our seats. to a member of the staff at your earliest convenience. Thank you. Attention, Event Square guests. Could make them bloom. That's make them bloom. Please speak to a member of the staff at your earliest convenience. Thank you. <laughs> Attention, Event Square guests. Could make them bloom. That's make them bloom. Congratulations. <laughs> Would you like to sing it? Me?
ricapit donde ero sit tres pelatores brafitis contor punto Jesus etia maure alter otisus rest sit superstes better than me. mechanical metropolis built of blood, sweat, and gears. The city of Garya. An insatiable machine devoid of pity. Neighbors on all sides fell victim to its hunger, while it grew larger and ever more powerful. The whirlwind of conquest swept up many, including him. Malfi was the traveler's name. In search of the goddess's blessing, he had journeyed forth alone. He flung himself into the fray in the hope of becoming a hero, only to be flung in jail and branded a felon. I must away. Release me! My blade thirsts for vengeance! Alfred, I'm here to rescue you. Rosa, how did you find me? Ye old princess intuition, I guess. You can thank me later. Of the goddess, as she has set me free, 
even now, so too shall she guide my place. <laughs> you know not whom you face, nor that you stand in his dominion. For I am Barbados, the Dragon King. And by the draconic power that courses through my veins, I shall give you ample cause to rue this day. Tremble in fear before the mighty dragon's roar! Have I seen a swordsman dance with such grace and skill? The goddess must have seen fit to grant him a sliver of her strength. Perhaps his dreams of becoming a hero may yet be fulfilled. Now then, ha, hail and well met, noble Alfred. Though I am but a humble fool, some talent and divination do I possess. Anything you wish to know, I shall gladly reveal. What is the future, if not the product of choices past? Each a fork in the road, none can divine the conclusion of every path. And yet, all tales that begin with a chance encounter share the same end. A tearful farewell. Well, that's enough of my blethering. It's time we set the stage in you. May my infernal fangs find their mark and taste of your flesh. display of swordsmanship, enough to prove his heroism once and for all. He had been unjustly imprisoned and stripped of his wings. Nevertheless, Alfred was resolved to press onward and reclaim the heavens. Now, without further ado... Friends, lend me your ears. Our aspiring heroes and indomitable princess's tale draws to a close. Only one act remains. Parting is indeed such sweet sorrow, but as they say, all good things must come to an end. Though it is our wish that this tale remain with you long after we are gone. 
So, my friends, will you join us in our conquest of despair? Spectacular! Though our tale be loveless named, we may yet restore hope to this heartbroken world. The Dragon King Varvados fears only true love, and so our hero Alfred will reveal to him its power. He will go to his beloved and proclaim their blessed bond with a kiss. Now, stand before your soulmate and let the world know your heart. I love. Alfred! <sighs> ah! Face the charade! Love is not but an illusion! <sighs> Bereft of wings and broken, I consign you to the abyss. That was pretty good. Heroic even. High praise coming from a princess. But don't let it go to your head. <laughs> what awaits you at journey's end, I wonder? Will the goddess grant you her blessing? Or will the flames of vengeance consume you? All shall be revealed, O oh puppet of fate. So dance while you still have time. Dance to your frayed strings break. And you can dance no more. Those I hold dear are waiting. I don't understand. I cannot. But... Please be safe. Rest assured, I shall return. You needn't promise that you'll wait. For I know that I will find you here. Everything okay? They're putting on a production tonight. Loveless. And I happen to have these tickets. I thought it'd be nice to see one of the plays Jesse was in and 
and I thought you might feel the same. No, you're not busy, so want to come with? Just you and me. Oh, just think of it as one of your jobs, Merc. Fine, but it'll cost you. Are you here to see Loveless? Also be invited to participate in tonight's revival. Once the show has begun, both the <sighs> Attention, Event Square guests. Could make them bloom. That's make them bloom. Come on. Please speak to a member of the staff at your earliest convenience. Thank you. <clears throat> Attention, Event Square guests. Could make them bloom. That's make them bloom. Please speak to a member of the staff at your earliest convenience. Thank you. Attention, Event Square guests. Could make them bloom. That's make them bloom. Congratulations. <laughs> Would you like to sing it? Me?
gonna need you to clap for the both of us. Those off? No. Those pillow marks say different. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. You got me. <laughs> anyway, want to broaden your artistic horizons? Loveless is playing here. And I got us tickets. Sure. After that, we could ride the Skywheel. I'm down for that. Cool. Loveless. Once the show has begun, both late entry and re-entry will not be permitted. Please take your seat. <sighs> Attention, Event Square guests. Could make them bloom. That's make them Come bloom. on. Please speak to a member of the staff <laughs> at your earliest convenience. Thank you. Attention, Event Square guests. Could make them bloom. That's make them bloom. Please speak to a member of the staff at your earliest convenience. Thank you. Attention, Event Square guests. Could make them bloom. That's make them bloom. Congratulations. <laughs> Would you like to sing it? Me?
Star. Today's performance takes audience participation to the next level. With our revolutionary technology, you will become the hero of the story. Only you can fell the Dragon King and win the princess's heart. A mechanical metropolis built of blood, sweat, and gears. The city of Garya. An insatiable machine devoid of pity. Neighbors on all sides fell victim to its hunger, while it grew larger and ever more powerful. The whirlwind of conquest swept up many, including him. Malfoy was the traveler's name. In search of the goddess's blessing, he had journeyed forth alone. He flung himself into the fray in the hope of becoming a hero, only to be flung in chain and branded a villain. I must away. Release me! My blade thirsts for vengeance! Fear not, Alfred. I've come for you. Rosa, how did you find me? I sensed you were in trouble. Twas the will of the goddess, perhaps. Shall she guide my place? Pride goeth before the fall, and I, Garm, shall deliver you to hell. How shall your feeble aegis fare against piercing fang and keenest claw? <laughs> You know not whom you Pride goeth before the fall, and I, Garm, shall deliver you to hell. How shall your feeble aegis fare against piercing fang 
and keenest claw. May my infernal fangs find their mark and taste of your flesh! I've seen a swordsman dance with such grace and skill. The goddess must have seen fit to grant him a sliver of her strength. Perhaps his dreams of becoming a hero may yet be fulfilled. Now then, ah, hail and well met, noble Alfred. Though I am but a humble fool, some talent and divination do I possess. Anything you wish to know, I shall gladly reveal. The Dragon King fears that which he lacks, none other than truest love, the strength of hearts conjoined. <clears throat> That singular weapon is mightier than the darkest magics or deadliest blows, and it alone can overthrow the king. Be still, my aching heart. Well, that's enough of my blethering. It's time we set the stage in you. Tremble in fear before the mighty dragon's roar. display of swordsmanship, enough to prove his heroism once and for all. He had been unjustly imprisoned and stripped of his wings. Nevertheless, Alfred was resolved to press onward and reclaim the heavens. Now, without further ado... Friends, lend me your ears. Our aspiring heroes and indomitable princess's tale draws to a close. Only one act remains. Parting is indeed such sweet sorrow, but as they say, all good things must come to an end. Though it is our wish that this tale remain with you long after we are gone. So, my friends, will you join us in our conquest of despair? Spectacular! Though our tale be loveless named, we may yet restore hope to this heartbroken world. The Dragon King Varvados fears only true love, and so our hero Alfred will reveal to him its power. 
he will go to his beloved and proclaim their blessed bond with a kiss. Now, stand before your soulmate and let the world know your heart. My love. Alfred. Ah! Face the charade! Love is not but an illusion! Ah! Goddess of love, let my blade strike true! Bereft of wings and broken, I consign you to the abyss. Thank you, Alfred, for saving our world and everyone in it. You are a true hero. <laughs> what awaits you at Journey's End, I wonder? Will the goddess grant you her blessing? Or will the flames of vengeance consume you? All shall be revealed, O oh puppet of fate. So dance while you still have time. Dance to your frayed strings break, and you can dance no more. Alfred, look. Those I hold dear are waiting. I don't understand. I cannot. But... Please be safe. Rest assured, I shall return. You needn't promise that you'll wait. For I know that I will find you here. Flow. 
Something else, huh? Oh, an Aerith song? I got a little misty-eyed there. Attention! The Sky Wheel will be closing soon. Please line up and have your ticket ready. <sighs> okay, then. That settles it. 
We've got to ride the sky wheel before it's too late, Cloud. Thank you for joining us for tonight's special performance of Loveless. If you'd like to continue the magic this evening, gonna drool on the seat. <laughs> Close call. doesn't leave the ride, okay? It might sound crazy, but back in Midgar, Aerith and I could both see the future. Well, that would explain a lot. I'm guessing you can't anymore, though? Nope. Not even a bit. Whatever we had, I think the Whispers took it from us when we left. Huh. It seems Arbiters of Fate can do whatever they want. So you told us. Oh, did I? Huh. I wonder if this means we'll eventually forget they even exist. We'd be better off if we did, frankly. There's no point in wasting our time worrying about fate if we can't change it. You're right. Still, there is one thing I need you to remember. You have to keep Aerith safe. Hmm. I mean it, Cloud. I don't remember what's supposed to happen, but I do know she's in danger. Drool on the seat. <laughs> Close call. <sighs> 
what's up. All right. This doesn't leave the ride, okay? It might sound crazy, but back in Midgar, Aerith and I could both see the future. Well, that would explain a lot. I'm guessing you can't anymore, though? Nope. Not even a bit. Whatever we had, I think the Whispers took it from us when we left. Huh. It seems Arbiters of Fate can do whatever they want. So you told us. Oh, did I? Huh. I wonder if this means we'll eventually forget they even exist. We'd be better off if we did, frankly. There's no point in wasting our time worrying about fate if we can't change it. You're right. Still, there is one thing I need you to remember. You have to keep Aerith safe. Hmm. I mean it, Cloud. I don't remember what's supposed to happen, but I do know she's in danger. Shake. What? Shake on it. soft. Huh? Nothing. Forget it. I'm glad that we could speak in private, Cloud. Yeah. You're good company. Thanks. my words. Next time, I'm gonna be the leading lady. And sing the Materia song? Just you wait. Attention! The Sky Wheel will be closing soon. Please line up and have your ticket ready. All right! Sounds like it's Sky Wheel time! Cut! Thank you for joining us for tonight's special performance of Loveless. If you'd like to continue the magic, here we are! The couples may ride the sky wheel at this time. Grab your friend or partner and embark on a wondrous trip through the sights and sounds of the gold saucer. Watch the adventure unfold before your very eyes, each moment more breathtaking than the last. This dazzling journey is sure to be one you won't soon forget. So this will be our... Are you ready to ride? <laughs> Practice makes perfect! Practice for what? Uh... For when the real thing comes around! <laughs> hey! Aren't you forgetting someone? Free 
busy after the move to Midgard that she forgot all about you, too. Don't know what it is about you guys, but I get it. I had a thing for a soldier once. At least I think he was a soldier. I wanted to prove myself, so I hit him with my best moves. Like I was firing energy blasts. After a few salvos, he shouted, You got me! And at the time, I totally bought it. Of course, he was just playing along for a dumb kid. And once I realized that, I was pissed. I couldn't stop thinking about him. I swore to myself that one day I'd blast that jerk for real. Did some hardcore training so I could give him a beatdown. But eventually, it dawned on me. He was just being nice. Like, he was a really nice guy. And the more I thought about it, the more I realized... Wow. I liked him. You know? Maybe it's because of those feelings that I still can't fire energy blasts. I can help. Uh, with the energy blasts? Or my feelings? The former. Feelings ain't my thing. <sighs> I think we both kinda suck in that department.
safe on their way back. Yeah. I also heard she used to have a pretty big crush on you. That's so. Well, not at first. Apparently, even as a kid, you had that weird loner vibe. But then one day, bam! She got the love bug! Are you into her? Don't remember. Really? Though, I guess that makes sense. Tifa said she was so busy after the move to Midgard that she forgot all about you, too. Don't know what it is about you guys, but I get it. I had a thing for a soldier once. At least I think he was a soldier. I wanted to prove myself, so I hit him with my best moves. <laughs> it was like I was firing energy blasts. After a few salvos, he shouted, You got me! And at the time, I totally bought it. Of course he was just playing along for a dumb kid. And once I realized that, I was pissed. I couldn't stop thinking about him. I swore to myself that one day I'd blast that jerk for real. Did some hardcore training so I could give him a beatdown. But eventually, it dawned on me. He was just being nice. Like, he was a really nice guy. And the more I thought about it, the more I realized... Wow. I liked him. You know? Maybe it's because of those feelings that I still can't fire energy blasts. I can help. Uh... With the energy blasts? Or my feelings? The former. Feelings ain't my thing. <sighs> I think we both kind of suck in that department. It was just practice. So, so don't go thinking it means anything, okay? Oh, say something! You're so annoying! See that guy again? What should I do? That's up to you. But if it were me, I'd let him have it. <laughs> Tell anyone about tonight, and you're a dead man. <laughs> Could even call it life-changing. Guess so. Maybe you ought to go pro. You know, I just might. Attention! The Sky Wheel will be closing soon. Please line up and have your ticket ready. Uh-oh. We gotta hurry. Last call, folks! Thank you for joining us for tonight's special performance of Legends. We ride the Sky Wheel at this time. Grab your friend or partner and embark on a wondrous trip through the sights and sounds of the Golden Saucer. Watch the adventure unfold before your very eyes. Each moment more breathtaking than the last. Are you this ready to ride? This journey is sure to be one you won't soon forget. So, 
Shall we? What do you think this does? Seems nothing like that. Well, you would know. Right now, I want to be with you. And I'm trying so hard to find you. But I'm right here. Yeah, you are. But... Hey. Did Tifa talk to you about, um... Hey, um, Aerith? I talked to Cloud. He said he remembers Zack. <gasps> How they were friends five years ago. What? I don't think so. At least, not about anything important. Oh. What do you think this does?
Check it out. This is insane. Chocobo racing's nothing like that. Well, you would know. <laughs> Right now, I want to be with you. And I'm trying so hard to find you. But I'm right here. Yeah, you are. But... Hey. Did Tifa talk to you? About, um... Hey, um, Aerith? I talked to Cloud. He said he remembers Zack. How they were friends five years ago. What? I don't think so. At least, not about anything important. Oh. tonight you're welcome but I didn't do anything <laughs> well market warriors you and me we'll show them tomorrow yeah The Sky Wheel will be closing soon. Please line up and have your ticket ready. Well, you heard him. Last chance to ride the Sky Wheel. Wanna end this on a high note? Thank you for joining us for tonight's special performance of Loveless. If you'd like to continue the magic this evening, you're invited to use your tickets to the show for one free ride on the Sky Wheel. Enjoy a stunning view. Name is Claire, and I'll get you there. Hold on, here, I can go. And here we are. Locals may ride the sky wheel at this time, friend or partner, and we've got a wondrous trip through the sights and sounds.
indubitable saucer. Watch the adventure unfold before your very eyes. Each moment, are you ready to ride? In the last, this dazzling journey. Are you really doing this? Could use some peace and quiet, couldn't you? Come on. What's this? Selfish little boy. If I was gonna win her heart, I had some growing up to do. Otherwise, she'd never give me the time of day. Funny enough, our first date was at a theme park. Nowhere near as big as this place, of course. Just a traveling fair with a handful of rides. Ended up riding these wooden chocobos round and round, laughing our asses off. <laughs> Look at me, boring you with my old stories. Wouldn't be the first time. Don't worry, I'm used to it. <sighs> yeah, well. The lesson here is once you find your soulmate, you never let him go. Although seeing that you're stuck riding this thing with me, I'm thinking you're probably already dead. Hey, you invited me. Right, because I learned to make the first move, which is exactly what you gotta do. Duly noted. Yeah. 
Incredible. <laughs> oh. at a theme park. Nowhere near as big as this place, of course. Just a traveling fair with a handful of rides. We ended up riding these wooden chocobos round and round, laughing our asses off. First time. Don't worry, I'm used to it. <sighs> yeah, well, the lesson here is once you find your soulmate, you never let him go. So, who is it? Hmm? Who's what? You know damn well what I'm talking about. Why do you always have to overthink things? That ain't no way to live. You gotta just go for it sometimes. You mean like you do, all the time? Hmm. Touché. <laughs> you could say that we balance each other out. Yeah. Amazing! I can't wait to start bragging. I'm friends with a famous singer. Well, maybe next time you could take the stage. <laughs> Attention! The Sky Wheel will be closing soon. Please line up and have your ticket ready. Well, the night's still young, right? What say we check it out? Thank you for joining us for tonight's special performance of Loveless. If you'd like to continue the magic this evening, you're invited to use your tickets to the show for one free ride on the Sky Wheel. Enjoy a stunning view of the gold saucer and the dazzling night sky. Let's name the square, and I'll get you there. Let's name the square, and I'll And here we are! Couples may ride the Sky Wheel at this time. Grab your friend or partner and embark on a wondrous trip through the sights and sounds of the Gold Saucer. Watch the adventure unfold before your very eyes, each moment more breathtaking than the last. This dazzling journey is sure to be one you won't soon forget. Are you 
ready to ride? You ready for this? A gondola's here! Well, after you. You first. Uh, Cloud? Think we can steer with this? Worth a try. <laughs> Here goes! Save. <laughs> hey, over there! See that? <sighs> Being a jockey looks so fun. That's definitely not what the races are like. I guess I'll just have to see for myself. They were friends five years ago. What? Not yet. Right. Touchy subject, huh? She must still have feelings for Zack. I think it's a little more complicated than that. Hey, it's kind of weird us being here like this, isn't it? Is it? I mean, I guess it is. Kind of. Ever since we left Midgar on this crazy journey, ever since we were kids even, I can't remember a time like this. A time when we were this close. Or am I getting ahead of myself again? Again? Yeah. Again. One bit.
Think we can steer with this? Worth a try. <laughs> Here goes! Safe. <laughs> hey, over there, see that? <sighs> Being a jockey looks so fun. That's definitely not what the races are like. I guess I'll just have to see for myself. They were friends five years ago. What? Not yet. Right. Touchy subject, huh? She must still have feelings for Zack. I think it's a little more complicated than that. It's kind of weird us being here like this, isn't it? Is it? I mean, I guess it is. Kinda. Ever since we left Midgar on this crazy journey, ever since we were kids even, I can't remember a time like this. A time when we were this close. Or am I getting ahead of myself again? Again? Yeah. Again. One bit. We should probably head back to our rooms. Yeah, probably. <laughs> <laughs> 